I served in the Senate for 270 years. I know I only look 40, but I'm a little bit older. The longest time I was too damn young because I was only about 29 when I got elected. Now I'm too damn old. But I'll tell you one thing in between. One of the finest, most decent men I've ever worked with. And I think of my think of integrity is Ben Cardin. Stand up, Ben. Stand up. They want to they the guy we're running against. What's his name? <laughs> Donald Dump or Donald whatever. They want to get rid of this, what we passed. They, they're fighting to get rid of what we've just passed. No, I'm serious. We finally addressed the long-standing issue that for years was one of the biggest challenges on this subject, which was that Medicare was prohibited by law from negotiating lower drug prices. And those costs then got passed on to our seniors, but not anymore. <laughs> Two years ago, we gave Medicare the power to negotiate lower prescription drug prices for the first time in history. And here is why that matters. It is nearly impossible for a patient to negotiate lower prices by themselves. Just think about that. Somebody who needs the medication, who may be suffering from a serious illness, that they would buy themselves be able to negotiate against a big drug company to lower that prices is virtually impossible. It's one person against a huge corporation. But Medicare represents more than 65 million people. And so Medicare has collective bargaining power. And now, Medicare can use that power to go toe-to-toe -to -toe with Big Pharma and negotiate lower drug prices. Thank you, Joe. 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 And you're soon to be senator. The whole lot easier job than being a county executive. I was a county, I was a county official. They expect you can solve every problem. You don't have the authority to do it. You don't have enough money. <laughs> but I hope I'm looking forward. I told her I campaigned for or against whichever helped the most. I served in the Senate for 270 years. I know I only look 40, but I'm a little bit older. The longest time I was too damn young because I was only about 29 when I got elected. Now I'm too damn old. <laughs> but I'll tell you one thing in between. One of the finest, most decent men I've ever worked with. And I think of my think of integrity is Ben Cardin. Stand up, Ben. Stand up. <laughs>